What? A second episode of Legacy Wednesday on the same day? Indeed it is. This is still the week of March 14th, and this time we are looking at Mario Kart Double Dash for the Nintendo GameCube. The fourth installment in the Mario Kart series, Double Dash introduced a variety of features, including two players per cart, character-specific special items, 12 brand new playable characters, and more. The game was released in November of 2003 in all regions. Now for some facts and trivia. The game features many references to Super Mario Sunshine. These include the Peach Beach course, the Cataquack enemies, NPC characters like the Pianta and Toadsworth, the tilt a cart battle stage, the Shine Thief battle mode, and the playable characters Bowser Jr., Petey Piranha, and King Boo. Luigi's Mansion also gets some love as the game features a Luigi's Mansion battle course, a playable King Boo, and the rank A mansion can be seen in the background of Luigi's Circuit. On the box art of the game, the L on Luigi's cap is backwards. Although he has appeared in every single Mario Kart game, this is the only time Toad was an unlockable character. Daisy Cruiser, a cruise ship made track, can be seen from a distance in Peach Beach and Yoshi Circuit. Daisy Cruiser is also seen in the Mario Kart Arcade GP's Mario Beach. Daisy Cruiser returns the retro track in Mario Kart 7 and is also featured as a field in Super Mario Sluggers. Despite selling nearly 7 million copies, Double Dash is the secondly successful Mario Kart, just ahead of Super Circuit which sold 5.5 million and before Mario Kart 7 which sold 7.5 million so far. Know any other interesting facts? Or perhaps you have a special memory or some thoughts on Double Dash? Let us know in the comments below. That is all for this week, and be sure to check out Timmy's Double T Thursday tomorrow. <laughs>